want to do the intro? No. Just do, just do the intro. Fuck nigger chink, bitch. <laughs> you don't want me doing this intro. Do the intro. Hi. Intro. I'm Joel. That's Brandon. This is Infamous. Episode insert number. Uh, last episode, we did some stuff, got some things, blew some shit up on the, the Space Needle. And uh, in this episode, we're going to be doing some more stuff and things and concrete versus smoke. Take it away, Brandon. He's not taking it away. He, he still hasn't taken it away. How's it going, everybody? It's Brandon, a.k.a. Dios, here, back for episode... Oh, so we drew s- that. <laughs> episode number six of our infamous Let's Play. In the last episode, you guys, we uh, cleared the uh, <coughs> Space Needle of DUP assholes. Happy New Year's. And, um... In today's episode, I'm not sure exactly what we need to do. I think we need to... New year, new me. I think we need to clear this part of the city a little bit. Maybe, uh, I don't know. So, Brandon, what's your New Year's resolution? My New Year's resolution? Um, you know what? Um, bring more puppies into my life. Yeah? Yeah. I'd say that's pretty solid. Yeah. I, wish, I really wish I had a dog. Are you going to get a dog when you get your own place? Yeah. 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 What's your favorite? Oh, there we go. Fourth and Vickers. Um, I wonder if that's a real place in Seattle. Um, <coughs> oh, excuse me. Um, what would you say your favorite type of dog is? Uh, Three-way tie. Between... Pitbull, Husky, and German Shepherd. I feel like that's, uh, I feel like those are pretty t- cool types of dogs. Yeah. I do like Huskies. Oh, they can be a little, uh... Loud? Yes. That's a good way to put it. They're a little loud. Let us know in the comments. Extremely hyper? <laughs> well, that doesn't bother me. <clears throat> How do you feel about Labs? It will at 2 a.m. Yeah, it will. Labs actually voted the best dog. Yeah. Well, I've... Just beating out retrievers. That's actually true. Look it up. No, I I believe you. I believe you. I mean, I, I like I like labs. I've, I haven't met a bad lab. You know what I mean? Meth labs. That's not... That's not <laughs> what I... You're just... You're just... I just don't like you. Um... Ooh, how tasty was it? Ooh. It was it was vanilla and chocolate combined tasty. I don't know what I'm talking about. I don't know what you're talking Leave about. Leave me alone, man. <laughs> if you put chocolate in vanilla, it just makes more chocolate. Is that how that works? Yes. Are you sure? Come on, man. I don't know if you're telling me the truth right now. Have you ever taken a spoonful of chocolate ice cream and vanilla ice cream at the same time? It just ends up tasting like just chocolate. I don't know if that's true. I, I'm 100% sure that's true. <laughs> should we uh, should we call, uh, should we text Ash Jeeves to see if that's true? Who the fuck uses Ash Jeeves? <laughs> Nobody. That's the joke. God. Get out of the 2000s, Brandon. Come on. I, I'm not. What's wrong with the 2000s, man? They were all right, I guess. Yeah, they were okay. Uh, mission light is locked. Destroy the nearby DUP mobile. Content. Okay, well, I guess we know what we're doing in this episode. Which one are they referring to? Are they taught? I assume this is what they're talking about. Sure, I'd say so. Okay, so we gotta we gotta storm the castle in today's episode. Let's uh, let's do that. How many dogs are you gonna get? Uh, two. Two dogs? Yeah. I assume one of each, at least. I mean, that would be three. Well, right. So be, like, but I mean, you're going to get, like, two of the three. Yeah. Is what I'm saying. I could get, um, you know what I'll do? I'll get a pit bull and then a husky German Shepherd mix. I was going to say, you could just mix them. Can I talk, about, can I talk for a second why I don't like pugs? 
Pugs? Pugs. Oh, you told me this. Okay. I did. I did. I did talk to you about this, but I haven't put it on camera yet. And the whole thing about pugs, like, yeah, they're cute and adorable and whatever. They're goofy. They're goofy, but they're like, they're like, what's the word? They're not like, um, what's the word I'm looking for? I don't know. They're not like DNA sound. Like their genetics are just like purposely fucked up to be that way. And that's why they all have like so many problems. And it's just like, it's just like really sad that we create something like that. Yeah, why not? For the laughs. For, yeah, do, do it, it for, for the, the walls. Vine. Yeah, do it for the vine. <laughs> we created this dog with so many problems just for to laugh at videos of it. Oh yeah, yeah. Like if if it gets too hot, they just like shut down too. I mean, like, well, I mean, bulldogs do that too. Well, yeah. But I mean, I mean what else don't... are people gonna like like look at on YouTube when they run out of cat videos? <laughs> they could look at whatever whatever pugs were and have them save buildings or save buildings, save people from burning buildings. What? <laughs> you wanna run that one by me one more time? <laughs> this time, less stroke. <laughs> yeah, they they could save people from burning buildings if they weren't like. Purposely disfigured. I don't. I wouldn't go that far. It kind well, of small to be rescuing, dragging people out of a burning building. Well, maybe their original genome isn't small. They don't have an original genome. They were the creation. Remember? Yeah, but of other genomes. I'm assuming one of them's a bulldog, so that's definitely not coming out of it. Wow. Well, see a bulldog try and carry a full-grown six-foot-four human male. No, but that would be great. To, that would be a probably. great YouTube video to watch, wouldn't it? That thing's not carrying <laughs> that guy anyway. At most, it's gonna rip his shirt. You gotta go buy a new shirt. Well, you know. Well, it gives you something to do than what. It gives you something better to do than watch YouTube videos. That's true. <laughs> Get you out, you know. I'm getting blown up. These snipers are not not treating me very well. I need uh, I need smoke. I don't have enough smoke. Yeah, you need the smokes, hon. <laughs> I can hook you up with the smokes. I haven't seen you in a grip. Shut up. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck you, bitch. That was kind of rude. Away. Eh. Fuck you. Yeah, fuck you. Fuck you and your sniper rifle. Who the fuck do you think you are? You want to fuck him and his sniper rifle? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I'll make it a threesome. That's kind of gross. Ah. Um. Uh, this is not going to work. <laughs> You're bad at games. Dude, this is at the high this is on the highest difficulty. Wow. Oh, I should probably know I should probably mention that in like the other episodes I'm like, "Oh, I'm not sure if this is on the ha hardest difficulty." It totally is. It's totally What's on. What's he a, doing? I don't. Uh, that I think was a glitch. Don't think he was supposed to be doing that. Um. So let's blow this shit up. I'm out of fucking juice again. You want some juice? Want some juice? Oh, you want some I juice? Get juice. There we go. Yeah. All right, come here, you fuck. Let me start my mission. Yes. There we go. Wait for it. Kaboom. See, he looked at the explosion, so he's not cool. Yeah, he's not quite cool, but it's okay. He hasn't he's, gotten the walk down yet. He hasn't. He, no, he hasn't. I mean, it, to be fair, it is something... It's it's hard to master. Not looking? Yeah. It's, it, well, I mean, Joel, if everybody could do it, then it wouldn't be cool when it happened, right? I mean, I, think, I feel like plenty of people can walk away slowly from fire. No. Yeah. Well, then that doesn't make it badass if everybody can do it. I mean, everyone can, though. No, they can't. Yeah, they can. No, they can't. Yeah, they can. I can't. It doesn't take much skill to just look away. If they can, why don't they? I don't know. I'm gonna kill this fucking radio tower. There we go. Oh god, you it can't, fell all you can't on top kill it. It's not a living thing. You're just I fucking hate everything about you. <laughs> it's true. 
You're Can't argue with the fucking facts. Fucking ugly, all right. Well, I mean that seemed kind of rude. Yeah, well, Brandon still prefers baths over showers. That's a weirdo. A, it's not. It's, it's not. It's not true. He also eats his pizza with a fork. Shut up. I was thinking. I was thinking about his one of his favorite sports announcers, Joe Buck. Oh, cause you take that back, you motherfucker! No, you take that shit back. You guys don't who know who Joe Buck is. He's the fucking scourge of the fucking. Well, it's between him and Chris Collinsworth. Yeah, but Joe Buck is way worse than Chris Collinsworth. And Phil Sims. Phil Sims. Phil Sims. I don't have a problem with. I hate Phil Sims. Fuck you, Phil Sims. If you're watching. Hey. Nice guitar. I want him dead. <laughs> <laughs> Who did we find out was an awful band today? Uh, What's the name of that band? I was like, wasn't it like it began with an A? American something. <sighs> something like that. <clears throat> I'll I'll put I'll put I'll put it on screen. Um, and and we found out that they're awful today. Like they were doing they were doing like a pre-game a pre like game concert and it was just awful. It was just awful. Who's um who's doing the halftime show? Coldplay. Oh, fucking that's right. Uh for the two thousand would that be the would that that would be the two thousand sixteen Super Bowl, right? Yeah. Okay. Super Bowl fifty. Super Bowl for Super Bowl fifty, uh the halftime show is being done by Coldplay and it's just like why? I mean, we could have another appearance of Left Shark. People would love that, though. I know, oh, a cameo by Left Shark? Yeah. Yeah. Um, so here, we have... Uh, what the fuck am I being shot by? Cops. Oh. All right, well... He said stun! Well, we're the bad guy, right? So. So... If you were an actual villain, like a super villain, what would your name be? Um, I, I don't know. Yeah, I got nothing. I don't know. My, uh, if I was, if I was a super villain, Darth Joel. <laughs> if if I was a super villain, I would be. My name would be Roadkill. And I would go around flattening people's tires. Queer. Okay, let's let's take some pictures. This guy really is Andy. Gone. It's <laughs> gonna even get a picture of the whole thing. I'm going to. Probably an electrical type. Yeah, probably. Looks electrical. I don't know. You think maybe fairy type? He maybe. All right, what else have we got? Selfie. But first, let me take a selfie. You already took a picture of that. Not something else. I think it was the person's face rather than the wounds. Ah. That's right. So, but yeah, that's what that's what I would do if I was a, if I was a super villain. You would just slash tires. I would slash people's tires. That's not really villainy. That's more just <laughs> a major inconvenience. Teenager fucking <laughs> fucking with my tires. <laughs> yeah, yeah, that's what that is. It's like one step above misdemeanor. But see, the thing is, like, I'm a villain because 
like that's not villainous. I would I would also I would also own like a good year. So all all the people no. come come to me for the tires that I broke. That's not villainous. It is vil- It's very villainous. No, it's not. Yes, it is. No, it's not. It's, of course, it's it a is. corrupt business. <laughs> not villainous. <laughs> Ow! Oh, come on. No way these guys would have known I was a bioterrorist. Fuck you up. But um. Well, you know what? It's better than your idea, Joel. I didn't have villain. one. Exactly. At least I was creative enough to come up with one. You were creative enough to come up with a stupid, <laughs> corrupt business scheme, not a villainous plot. <laughs> oh, sorry. I'm sorry I'm not a villain who wants to take over the world, Joel. What exactly makes a villain not a corrupt business plot? <laughs> of course it does! It's like money laundering. <laughs> Dude, what the fuck is Kingpin, man? Oh my god. He's a super villain. God. And he's just a monster. Oh my god! All I'm saying is, it's a stupid villain plot. <laughs> yeah. What's the name of your arch nemesis gonna be? Oh, like the superhero? Yeah. <sighs> Rubber boy? <laughs> no. The detailer. He details cars. Shut. <laughs> <up>. <laughs> You know what I picture this being? Well, being like some <laughs> shitty like reality TV show scenario where it's just like, oh no, my boss is being is being corrupt. Oh, do I tell them? Do I stay employed and keep my job? Should I take this bribe? No, you know what? I'm gonna do the right thing. Like that's what that sounds like. It just sounds like a shit sitcom. <laughs> well, I mean, shit sitcoms make a lot of money. Not for the right reasons. That's you know what. How many That's people okay. do you know that talk about two every day? <laughs> Not a lot. Exactly. I mean, we used to reference that shit all the time, though. Did we? We did. I don't think we did. Focus! That was one thing. <laughs> yeah. But, I mean, also, like... That one-hit wonder? Well, yeah. Like, Ayaz or Ja Rule. <laughs> or that band that we were talking about yeah, earlier that, that we don't that remember the name earlier. of. I'm getting shot Cee-Lo by a Green. lot of stuff. Man. Yeah, and CeeLo Green's on the voice now. Mano. Hinder. Hinder. Uh, I think they had another good song. Did they? I think so. I think they did. Can you name it? No. There you go. There's Lips of an Angel and... I don't know. I mean, there's also Finger Eleven. Another one-hit wonder band. Sure. It's... it. it, it I'm, I promise you, it is the thing. God, there's so many guys around here. And Brandon, that villainous scenario that you were talking about <laughs> yeah. is exactly the same thing as a kid that did something very similar down at school where he stole my friend's iPhone, touched it up... Like, fixed the cracked screen and sold it back to him. That's fucked. Yeah, that's the same thing. That's not villainous, that's just scumbaggy. Hey, sometimes they're the same thing. No, it's... No! (laughs) Are you sure? Yeah. I think, you know, I think Batman, like, flying through Gotham, having to deal with plenty of, like, you know, actual villains with actual plots... I think you'd have something better to do than, you know, deal with somebody slashing tires. Well, that's... that's I feel why, like that's Commissioner what, Gordon could deal with that on his well, own. Well, yeah, that's why... I mean, he needs that's, a that's why that. it, it, the detailer take, takes it up. He was like, I'm going to deal with the tiny shit that Batman doesn't have time for. That's what Robin's for. Oh, yeah, because Robin doesn't die, like, every single time. Yeah, well, you know, I never said he was good at his job. I said he well, had Well, now we need someone good. It's going to be the detailer. Rubber boy? <laughs> yeah, yeah, sure. <laughs> I'm telling you, this is not a villainous <laughs> plot. <laughs> Let us know in the comments how stupid you think Brandon is. <laughs> hey, let's not be mean. Every superhero is created equally. <laughs> Except for Rubber Boy. <laughs> <laughs> there was a thing I saw, I forget what the name of the show was, but it was a show about like people who got powers, but they were useless powers. Like one guy, one guy's power was he could turn invisible for thirty seconds. Yes, 
<laughs> that could be useful if you're quick. I was, it was like, yeah, yeah, I could, I could turn invisible for thirty seconds. That's my power. I mean, that could be useful. Like, imagine you see like a professor in the hall that you really don't want to talk to. Just yeah. run by him invisible, real quick. It, it, it gets you out of awkward situations. Yeah. The awkward Your situation. Your ex is coming down the street. And you're like, oh shit, I don't want to talk to this bitch cunt. And then like. You just go invisible. And then you fuck with her for 30 seconds. <laughs> or say there's like a manager that you really want to take out. So, so We don't know what happened. It was just a random heart attack. So basically what you're saying is your supervillain would be... Would turn invisible for 30 seconds. No, I'm just making the best out of a shit power. And say that would be mine. And maybe that's his backstory. He's like, I have a shit power, and the only thing I can do with it is evil. Is fuck with people. So I became evil. And and the detailer is trying to stop me. Oh, yeah. The detailer's coming after you, too. <laughs> you gotta stop with this stupid scenario. <laughs> do I, though? Yeah. Oh, God. There is so many fucking dudes here. This is... Why are all the dudes fucking? <laughs> Is that Listen, kind of party? Yeah, I guess so. I gotta get some smoke, man. Uh, okay. I mean, that's like a window company rolling up to a fucking store, breaking the window and saying, oh yeah, we can fix that for you. Yeah. That's not villainous. Oh, that guy's name would be... Um, uh, Crystal Nosh. What the fuck are you talking about? <laughs> That guy's name would be Crystal Nosh. He's a Crystal Nosh. What the fuck are you talking about? <laughs> that's the that's the um, that's the thing in Poland where like the Germans or in Germany when like the uh, Nazis first started coming into power, they started like fucking up uh, German or uh, Jewish businesses and stuff. And that night is called the Crystal Nosh, which is Night of the Broken Glass in German. Shut up. That's that would be that guy's name. I hate you so much. Do you? Yeah, this isn't a villainous plot. This is just stupid. It might be. But um, I think... Uh, I think... I'm going to kill this guy really quick. I think in the next episode, we will investigate this next thing here. So, if you enjoyed, hit the like button and subscribe for more. But while you do that, I'm going to get out of here. Have a good day or night, depending on where you are. Hate is love. Hate is life. That, that makes sense like Shrek. Dude, Shrek is... Shrek is everything to me.